Hello, this is Matthew Robert Payne, and <clears throat> this is a personal prophecy for Jennifer. Uh, if you're just tuning in and watching this on YouTube, you can uh, go to the description tag and go to my website and request a personal prophecy for yourself. Uh, if you're not going to do that, uh, please enjoy uh, listening to someone else's prophecy and uh, may it encourage you too. Uh, so, Jennifer, uh, I'll just pray and dedicate this to the Lord. So, dear Father, I pray that uh, you'd give me a word for Jennifer, a word to bless her, encourage her, and lift her spirits up. In Jesus' name I ask, amen. Um, when I had your prophecy request and as I was preparing uh, to uh, do this video, I just had a wonderful uh, feeling. Um, I even addressed your email saying I, it's an honour to do a prophecy for you. Um, the Lord uh, loves you so much. Uh, you're so uh, loved. Uh, he's put his love uh, in uh, my heart for you it's like it's like he wants to wrap you up uh, in sheepskin it's like he wants to smother you with warmth and comfort um, <clears throat> I sense uh, that Jesus uh, really uh, delights in you um, I'm not sure uh, if uh, you speak back and forth uh, to Jesus. Um, I uh, just did a prophecy uh, where I encouraged uh, someone uh, to journal um, and uh, journal with the Lord. And something I encourage you to do, uh, even if you're already journaling uh, with the Lord, I encourage you uh, to do more of it. Um, the Lord uh, really uh, wants to speak to you uh, personally, one-on-one, -on -one, and uh, he really uh, desires uh, to be cut, to become <coughs> a really uh, dear friend of yours. Um, <coughs> you've uh, got a heart of uh, compassion and uh, mercy and uh you uh, demonstrate uh, mercy. Um, it, mercy is one of my spiritual gifts. And it says on the spiritual gifts test, the gift of mercy is a divine strength or ability to feel empathy and to care for those who are hurting in any way. Um, you've got that gift of mercy and uh uh, you also, um, it's like you've got um, my gift set almost. Um, I believe you have the gift of exhortation too. As the gift of exhortation is a divine strength or ability to strengthen, comfort, or urge others to action through the written or spoken word and biblical truth. Uh, I believe uh, you have that gift too. <clears throat> I sense uh, that uh, the Lord uh, wants you uh, to learn uh, to speak to him back and forth and uh, wants uh, you to learn to prophesy. I've got a book called uh, Prophetic uh, Evangelism Made Simple, and that's a book I encourage you uh, to purchase and read and apply and learn how to prophesy. Um, I sense uh, that the Lord uh, Jesus uh, wants uh, you to uh, go about your day meeting strangers and prophesying to them and bringing a special message from him uh, to strangers. Um, I sense that uh, he wants to uh, use your mouth and use your arms and use your finances to extend his kingdom on earth. I sense 
uh, that uh, you have a, spe a special empathy uh, for people. Um, you've got this uh, real caring attitude uh, for other people and I sense that uh, Jesus uh, wants to use you uh, to bless people and uh, encourage people and lift people up. And I sense uh, that he wants to use you prophetically uh, to speak uh, to people, to speak words of encouragement to people, to encourage them and lift them up and uh, and uh, lead them uh, towards uh, their destinies. Um, I, I sense uh, that uh, you uh, will uh, give uh, people uh, prophetic words that speak about uh, their purpose and uh, their future and uh, and uh, I can really see you uh, demonstrating uh, prophetic evangelism. Uh, there's a number of books on prophetic evangelism uh, and uh, I encourage you uh, uh, to uh, get them. Um, there's uh, my book um, and... Um, I'm just uh, having a look uh, at a book. Um, um, so um, uh, there's um, a book called Prophetic Evangelism by Sean Smith. Um, um, and uh, you can uh, get that book. Um, um, I, I'd encourage you to um, read all the books on prophetic evangelism uh, that you can see on Amazon. Go through them one by one, and they'll have uh, good stories in them. I, I sense that... Uh, that uh, the Lord and the Lord uh, told me uh, this uh, just shortly um, before, um, uh, a couple of minutes ago, um, I sense that uh, you're going to become as prolific in prophetic evangelism as me. So I just uh, pray now uh, that uh, the Lord, uh, so let's pray, uh, dear Father, I pray that uh, you would give me the three gifts of prophecy, uh, uh, personal prophecy, uh, the, the gift of uh, prophecy, the gift of word of knowledge, and the gift of word of wisdom. I, I um, ask that uh, you give me these three gifts and uh, give me the gift of discernment of spirits so I can see angels and uh, meet with you face to face. And I pray that uh, you would activate these gifts. And I pray also that um, you would uh, give me uh, Matthew's uh, mantle uh, when it comes to uh, prophetic evangelism, that I would be as effective as he is and uh, touch thousands of lives uh, throughout my life. In Jesus' name I ask. Amen. So I encourage you uh, to uh, go out and uh, touch people's lives uh, because it's really deeply aligned uh, with uh, your gift of exhortation and your gift of mercy. Um, and uh, I um, sense that uh, you'd love to uh, change lives. Um, uh, ev prophetic evangelism, uh, sharing prophecies with strangers isn't threatening in any way. It's just uh, bringing a personal message of Jesus to a person and uh, and that's uh, really encouraging for them and it's a blessing uh, for non-Christians to receive um, a personal message of Jesus and uh, it touches them and uh, lifts them up. You, you, as I explained 
uh, in uh, my book, Prophetic Evangelism and Made Simple, um, you don't have to lead the person to Christ. Uh, you are just planting seeds uh, for the gospel, seeds uh, that will be watered and seeds that will be harvested uh, by someone else. Um, and uh, I plant uh, thousands of seeds in people's lives. Uh, be encouraged that Jesus uh, really loves you. He would love you to journal. He'd love you to read prophetic evangelism uh, books and uh, become uh, a real expert uh, in prophetic evangelism. I can see you uh, reading books on how to pray for the sick and how to heal the sick. Uh, there's a good book called Divine Healing Made Simple by a Praying Medic. Um, I encourage you to read that book. And uh, whilst you're doing prophetic evangelism, uh, you can also use the opportunity to pray uh, for the afflict afflicted and the sick. Um, I pray that uh, this prophecy has uh, really encouraged you and, uh, and blessed you. I look forward to your feedback. God bless.